Bloom CRM has a lot of buzz, but before you invest, there are 12 things you need to know to decide if it's right for your business and how it compares to other CRMs on the market. Stick around because we'll also share a better alternative you can try for free. First, Bloom CRM is designed for creative professionals like photographers, designers, and event planners. It combines project management, invoicing, and communication tools in one platform, which is great for streamlining your workflow. However, compared to all-purpose CRMs like HubSpot or Pipedrive, Bloom's niche focus might feel limiting if your needs extend beyond creative industries. Next thing, Bloom CRM offers built-in payment processing through integrations like Stripe and Square. It's convenient, but the fees can add up. Competitors like Dubsadoo often offer more flexible payment processing options or allow you to pass fees to clients. The third thing to know is its client portal. Bloom provides a branded space where clients can review contracts, invoices, and project details. It's a standout feature for creating a professional client experience. However, if you're managing larger teams, platforms like Monday.com offer more robust collaboration tools. The fourth thing is Bloom's automated workflows. From sending follow-ups to collecting payments, it saves time. But the automation is more basic compared to CRMs like Zoho, which offer advanced triggers and multi-step workflows. If your business needs deep customization, this could be a limitation. Next, Bloom includes marketing tools like email templates and campaign tracking. While helpful for creatives, it lacks advanced analytics and segmentation tools available in systems like ActiveCampaign or Salesforce. If marketing is a priority, you might outgrow Bloom quickly. Another key point is pricing. Bloom CRM offers a simple flat rate subscription, which is attractive for freelancers and small teams. But if you're scaling and need enterprise features, tools like HoneyBook might provide better long-term value. Seventh, let's talk about its mobile app. Bloom's app is clean and easy to use, perfect for managing your business on the go. However, it lacks some of the desktop version's features. CRMs like Insightly or HubSpot often provide a more seamless mobile experience. The eighth thing is integration. Bloom supports third-party tools like Zapier, but the list is limited compared to broader CRMs that integrate directly with hundreds of apps. If you rely on a diverse tech stack, this might be a drawback. Now, customer support. Bloom offers live chat and email support, which is responsive. But unlike competitors like Freshworks, there's no 24-7 support or dedicated account manager for premium plans, which could be a deal breaker if you need hands-on assistance. The 10th thing is its user interface. Bloom is visually appealing and intuitive, making it easy to get started without a steep learning curve. But for complex projects, its simplicity might leave you wishing for more depth, which tools like ClickUp or Notion provide. Next, Bloom's reporting features are basic. You'll get an overview of payments, client activity, and projects, but it's nowhere near the detailed insights offered by CRMs like Zoho or Pipedrive. If data is critical to your business decisions, you may feel underwhelmed. Lastly, data ownership and security. Bloom takes client privacy seriously, but the platform doesn't offer the same level of compliance certifications or encryption features as enterprise CRMs. If your business handles sensitive data, it's worth considering alternatives like Salesforce. So, is Bloom CRM worth it? For creative professionals seeking a simple, streamlined tool, it's a solid option. But if you want a more versatile CRM with advanced features and broader integrations, check out our recommended solution, which you can try for free.